Mitchell Northam here for West Virginia Sports Now. I'm outside Boshomer Stadium here in Chapel Hill, North Carolina, where West Virginia University's baseball team just played in the Super Regionals, the NCAA Tournament, for the first time in program history. Now, the night didn't end the way how the Mountaineers wanted it to. They lost in walk-off fashion to the North Carolina Tar Heels, 8-6. Now, the Mountaineers did get a great pitching performance from Derek Clark, their ace, who threw nearly a complete game. He got pulled just a few pitches into the bottom of the ninth inning, not long after he gave up the game-tying home run. But Clark threw 144 pitches, which is just an insane amount for one outing and a season high for him. A few pitches after Clark got pulled is when Vance Honeycutt of North Carolina hit a two-run shot, an absolute no-doubter, over the left field wall to secure the win for the Tar Heels. Now, the Mountaineers also got a great performance at the plate today from Kyle West, who had two home runs himself and four RBI. Scott Forbes, UNC's coach, told us in a press conference just now that one of his assistant coaches putting together the scouting report told him about Kyle West. He said, hey, this guy is dangerous if he gets into the game. Now, Kyle West hadn't played all that well coming into this game. He had just one hit in his last 10 games, but tonight he came through in a big way, getting those two dingers putting West Virginia up 6-4 to four midway through this one. They just couldn't hang on to that lead in the bottom of the ninth. Now, Kyle Swatolski is going to get the ball on the mound on Saturday night for West Virginia in what is a win-or-go-home game. He's a 6'4 left-hander, spent last season at Gardner-Webb before transferring into West Virginia this year, and he's had a pretty good season. At the regionals last weekend against Grand Canyon, he pitched seven and two-thirds innings in a win and gave up just one run. So, Good pitcher going on the mound tomorrow night for West Virginia. Again, it's a winner go home game. The stakes have never been higher for this program. Will they extend the career of head coach Randy Mazey, who's already announced his retirement, or will they send the Tar Heels to Omaha? Tune into West Virginia Sports now to keep updated with everything going on in the Super Regional.